Shalom, this is Rabbi Arye Lang and a message for the week. So what is it about a birthday that we try to celebrate? You know that there's our Hebrew Jewish birthday, which is based on the Jewish calendar. And it's important for us to find that out. You can go on our website to get more info on that. What do we celebrate for our birthday? This week we celebrated the birthday of Moses and his passing. And it actually says that Haman was happy when he threw a lottery one day he was going to try to kill the Jews and it fell out on the month that Moses passed away. But God laughed at him and said, you don't realize it's also the birthday of Moses. And basically, the idea of the birthday is we're celebrating another soul coming down to earth. Your birthday really celebrates your soul coming down, which is part of God. Regardless of your accomplishments, regardless of how well you've done so far in your activities, it's celebrating you for who you are. That is that bond, the Jewish people and God, that is beyond description, beyond what we've accomplished, how many commandments we've fulfilled, how much Torah we know. It's just celebrating who we are. And that's the mazel of this month. The month of the birth of Moses, the leader of the Jews, represent, represents the birth of all the Jewish people, that we have a soul and we celebrate that. And that is brought out when Haman tried to kill our people in the time of Purim, the Jews... Not one of them converted out of Judaism, even though for a year straight they, were, they had the noose hanging that they would be killed. And if we converted out, we would not not be killed. The Jewish people stood strong because of the core of who we are. We are inseparable from God regardless. So let's celebrate our Jewish soul. Let's celebrate our Jewish birthdays. And let's celebrate Purim this coming Monday night and Tuesday. See more in the email. 539 candlelighting today. Shabbat Shalom. Have a happy Purim.